This video describes the removal and replacement in November of the temporary bridge over the LaSalle Causeway in Kingston. The work was undertaken for priestly demolition by Western Mechanical Electrical and Millwright Services, with considerable assistance from the captain and crew of the tug Radium Yellowknife. Loading the equipment and stores that would be used to lift the bridge was an early task. Six water pumps that would be used to fill and empty the barge were amongst the essential items. Once the team from Weston was on board the barge, it was time to ready four powerful hydraulic jacks. Transferring these heavy objects from the tug to the barge required a lot of movement. An electric generator was another heavy object to be transferred. The four hydraulic jacks, designed and made specifically for this task, fit in the pockets, one of which you see here on the side of the barge. The barge rides low in the water, having taken a great deal on board, and the jacks are lowered, ready to go under the bridge. Positioning the barge under the bridge requires considerable skill and close coordination. The frame on which the bridge will rest must be precisely positioned.
As the last critical moments arrive, control of the whole assembly is in the hands of one man. Next morning, conditions for the lift are almost ideal. Whilst pumps are readied, we can have a look under the bridge at the cradles from which it will be raised. In the reverse of the operation undertaken yesterday to lower the barge, today water will be pumped out to provide positive buoyancy and lift. Pedestrian ramps are detached. The lifting process is a gentle one, the effects of which can readily be seen. Note here the very narrow gap between the bridge and the roadway. You might notice here that the jacks have yet to play their part. In this shot, you can see the jacks have begun to rise. With the additional clearance they give, the bridge can gently be withdrawn. Once completely clear of the groins, the tug can take the barge and bridge to a place of safety whilst marine traffic uses the waterway. Just before 4 p.m., the tug and barge, with the bridge, move to replace it.
understandably, the approach is a very controlled one. Spotters on either end of the bridge provide precise positioning information to the captain of the tug. The old sailor's warning never approach anything faster than you're prepared to hit it, comes to mind. The first few feet in the gap are perhaps the most challenging. Once the bridge is in position, it can be slowly and carefully lowered into the rests prepared to receive it. The jacks are down and the barge will be filled sufficiently to allow her to be released from the bridge. After this last removal of the year, she'll spend the winter here. I'm sure you'll join me in congratulating all those involved in this enterprise. Thanks for watching.